Are you ready to transform your summer into an epic splash-tastic adventure? Say goodbye to wasteful, single-use water balloons and hello to the ultimate in reusable, eco-friendly fun with reusable water balloons. Check out the link in the video description to get yours on Amazon today. Britain's Got Talent star Connie Talbot was offered a place on Love Island 17 years after first finding fame but decided to reject the ITV show. At just six years old, Connie bounded onto the stage and showed Simon Cowell, Piers Morgan, and Amanda Holden her beautiful voice. Her rendition of Judy Garland's Over the Rainbow drove Amanda to tears, and she admitted to being a complete mess after the performance. Famously hard to impress Simon told the youngster she was fantastic, and the young hopeful sailed through to the next round. Her vocal talent, which was beyond her years, took her all the way to the final in 2007 before she eventually finished as a runner-up to Paul Potts. That didn't stop her from selling 250,000 copies of her debut album, which reached number one in three countries and made Connie the youngest ever solo female artist to enter the UK charts. Nearly two decades later, Connie, now 23, is still releasing music and she's so focused on her goals that she even rejected Love Island. I got asked to go on Love Island, which is completely alien to me. I'm just focused on music and television is like a whole different thing really, she told the son. I respect it as a show, but it's just not for me. I couldn't do it, and it's not my dream. After previously being signed to Rainbow Recording Company, she's now releasing songs as an independent artist, including EP Growing Pains, and is enjoying the freedom it grants her. Although she's grateful to Britain's Got Talent for the experience, it's taken her a while to fully embrace that part of her life. I think there was a time where I was like I'm going to completely change the way I look and just not talk about BGT, just totally blank it out of my life, she honestly shared. Connie added, I sort of embrace it a little bit more and just appreciate that people will always sort of remember me as that little girl, which is fine. Connie returned to the franchise in 2019 and competed in Britain's Got Talent, the champions and then America's Got Talent the champions the following year. Her various successes on the show have helped her to become the musician she wants to be now. Charlie Simpson refuses to change Busted's icky lyrics to suit modern times. Huge 80s TV detective series reboot gets new cast including Harry Potter legend. Love Island star faces jail after being caught smuggling cocaine in 53 million pound operation. Emmerdale fans bewildered by missing episode as it is pulled from screens without warning. I feel quite privileged that all that work that was put in as a child is allowing me to still be an independent artist today and do something that I love every day, she stated. Connie will be performing three intimate gigs in Birmingham, London, and Manchester during September. Britain's Got Talent is streaming on ITVX. Inside Downing Street's many makeovers, with a mirrored gym and 2,000-pound wallpaper. Mum transforms rented council house into Bratz Shrine despite threat of 7,000 pound fine. Landlords are imposing an utterly ridiculous rule on tenants, but it's perfectly legal. Inside the Victorian boathouse that's just sold for twice the price of a UK home. Get paid to live on this idyllic European island, but there's a catch. More, ITV news presenter quits channel after 21 years. More, how Gaudier took the noble route out of fame and made a dead man millions. More, ITV blasted by police over disgusting title of new comedy.